Let's make this short, quick, and simple. Easy. Easy. The Eagles are going to beat the Raiders on Christmas. Um, it's a Christmas present that I don't really care about. I wouldn't mind taking the seed, number one, obviously, and that's really what we are looking for, what we really need, the home field advantage. So, essentially, that Christmas present is great. Um, and I think that they're going to get it. Uh, however they'll get it is however they'll get it. it. It might be an easier game. It might be the most difficult game of the season. Um, which was, you know, the Rams, but you, you, you get the point. Um, I made a video yesterday saying that the defense is going to, uh, is going to rebound, you know, because you're back at home, and you're fighting for home field advantage, and you're going to be fighting at home for the rest of the season, um, wherever that goes, until, of course, February, if you make it to February. Um, so, getting this win is important, very important. Um, Nick Foles... Had a career game against the Giants, you know, four touchdowns, second time he's ever gotten four or more. The one and only time before that was the seven touchdowns against the Raiders. And I find it kind of coincidental that he's playing the Raiders uh, once again, you know, as an Eagle. So, um, as far as what I'm expecting and all that stuff, I'm just expecting what I've been expecting or been wanting for this team this entire season. That's just... Consistency, you know, just being consistent, balanced, um, and I'm really looking forward to seeing what the defense will do against Amari Cooper, uh, Derek Carr, and Beast Mode. You can never, uh, uh, you can never say no to Beast Mode. You can't just say, yeah, he's not the same. Uh, he might be older, but you, the past couple of weeks I've been watching him. He's been running a lot better than he did at the, you know, start of the year. So you can never really rule out him. Um, that defense is very young and is very talented. They're 6-8, and eight, but don't let that deceive you because this team has had their ups and their downs this year. Uh, but I do expect the Eagles, since they've been the most balanced team on a consistent basis this year out of the entire NFL, uh, I got the Eagles winning. So tell me in the comments down below what you guys think, and uh, I'll see you guys on Christmas. Peace out.